but thanks to the gods. He's now resting with his ancestors. Orotimu wa fe agbero la arin ara wa ni pe. Ta si gboro da nre lola. Pe ta ni o joko sori apere. Emini. The gods named me king through my father. When he stood at the curtain of the land of the living and dead. Therefore, hearing directly from the gods. <laughs> lie. All lie. Words from a man who was always partial towards you. We do not even know if he spoke those words. Yes. The two men who started the rumors, Ba Mikekere and Baba Wojide, did the gods not strike them down? They were struck down when Balogun was trying to steal the throne. Which is how the gods showed that they were going against their wills and I should be king. The gods broke my chains and set me free so that I will come. Are you going to tell this lie to my face because I let you tell it? Oh, the same. How? The same. Both power-hungry fools, overindulged boys who will run this kingdom to the ground. Neither of them knows what it means to be a ruler or the responsibility that comes with that position. Just wish women could be kings. Things have always been like this in the UK. Have they? Because whichever one of them is made king tomorrow, this kingdom is just going to waste away in their hands. Today is a good day. Okay. Today is a good day because we are doing something that determines the destiny of our great kingdom, the very existence and the future. It cannot be overstated, the importance of obeying the will of the gods. Mm. On behalf of the gods, Sanolofi, I am here to declare the king of Ibaoka. Mm. This is not a message that I make lightly or a declaration I bear carelessly. The king is a representation of the gods to the people. The one that will sit upon the throne of Ibaokuta, just like the father before him. Yes. Of Bafen. Hey. The new king of Ibaokuta. God is real.